Now, those weren't their real names. No, their real names were, uh, let me see if I can get this right. Uh, Shadrach, Meshach, and uh, Abednego. <laughs> Uh, of course, nobody could remember those, so we took to calling them Rack, Shack, and Benny. Anyways, they came with a bunch of other boys and girls that Mr. Nezzer brought in to work at his chocolate factory. Well, who's Mr. Nezzer? Ah, we'll get to that later. Who am I? Why, I'm George. Anything that goes in or out of Nezzer chocolate gotta come by me. Well, speaking of which, it's almost 8 o'clock. Time for the morning milk delivery. Here comes Laura now. Well, she's my favorite. Good morning, George. How are you? I hope you're feeling fine. I'd love to stay and talk, but it's almost 8 o'clock and I haven't got the time. See you later. Because we work real hard at the chocolate factory. We start at 8 and we don't get lunch till 3. I gotta drive a truck to make a buck so I can sell. You are in trouble Your time card is a wreck It's almost two past eight I'll tell Nezzer that you're late And he'll take it from your check Yes, Mr. Lunt Oh, yes, we work real hard At the chocolate factory Excuse me, Mr. Lunt, but I've got an injury Now get back on the line You'll be just fine With all this work to do We've got no time for sin with me We used to be so happy We used to laugh and run Now there's no time to play Cause we gotta work on it And it isn't very fun I'm Rack I'm Jack I'm Benny We work here in the plant We'd like to take a break For goodness sake But Mr. Nazar says You can't! <laughs> we all need a vacation Take a few. Oh, yeah, Mr. Nezzer. Nebby K. Nezzer. Uh, but you better call him Mr. Nezzer. Now, Mr. Nezzer's not a bad man. He just gets confused sometimes. Why, his chocolate bunnies are selling so well, I, I think he's gotten a little big for his britches. And that's saying something, because his britches were pretty big to start out with. What's all this have to do with Rack, Shack, and Benny? Well, their troubles start when Mr. Nezzer makes a little announcement. Attention, little people! I have an announcement! This morning, Nezzer Chocolate shipped its two millionth chocolate bunny! <laughs> To celebrate this momentous occasion, for the next 30 minutes, everyone may eat as many bunnies as they want. Bon appetit. Hey, boss, that's awfully nice of you giving away all those bunnies. Oh, if I could just see the looks on their faces right now. I don't think we should eat any more bunnies. Well, what do you mean? Mr. Nezzer said we could eat as many as we, we want. Well, don't you remember what our parents taught us? We shouldn't eat very much candy because it's not very good for us. 
Shaq, our parents aren't here now. We're on our own. Besides, everybody else is doing it. Rack, Benny, listen to me. I know our parents aren't here right now, but I keep thinking of a song my mom used to sing to me a long time ago. Think of me every day, hold tight to what I say, and I'll be close to you even from far away. Know that wherever you are, it is never too far, if you think of me. If you think of me, I'll be with you. You see? Even though our parents aren't here right now to help us do what's right, if we remember what they taught us, it's kind of like they are here. <laughs> okay, no more bunnies. I'm doing it for my mom. <laughs> me too. Well, that about does it. What do you say we pop in and let them show their appreciation? Oh, yeah. They really gonna appreciate you, boss. Hello? Hmm. I don't feel very appreciated. Hey, look. They are lying on the floor like they're sick or something. Hmm? You mean I let them eat my bunnies and in return they all want to play hooky? Wait, boss. Those three guys over there, they don't look sick. Oh? Hmm. Ahem. <clears throat> Thank you, Mr. Nezer, for your lovely gift of chocolate. Yeah, thanks! Everybody else is lying down, but you three are standing up. Actually, boss, I think the tomato is sitting. I'm standing. Sitting. Look, this is sitting, and this is standing. I'm standing. Okay, he's standing. What are your names, boys? I'm Shadrach. I'm Meshack. I'm a bumblebee. A Benny Boo. I'm Benny. We can use boys who know how to stand up here at Neza Chocolate. How would you like to be junior executives? What's it mean? It means you have to wear a tie. Sure, that'd be great. All righty, Mr. Lunt, get them their ties. Right away, boss. Boys, I want to see you in my office first thing in the morning. Yes, yes sir. sir. Well, what do you know? Rack Shack and Benny did what they thought was right, even though nobody else was doing it. And it paid off. This time, anyway. But boy, were they in for a surprise when they got to Mr. Nezzer's office the next day. Boys, have I got a surprise for you. The other day, I was thinking about the Nezza chocolate bunny, thinking about how wonderful the bunny is, how beautiful the bunny is, and I thought to myself, I thought, oh, if only all my workers love the bunny as much as I do. I asked myself, why don't they love it as much? Do you know why? Because it's small. It's a little bunny. What they need is a bunny they can look up to, and I mean way up to. This is just a model. The real bunny is 90 feet high. My workers finished it this morning. Wow, that's a big bunny, sir. Mm-hmm. Since you're my junior executives, I wanted you to see it first. But this afternoon, everyone will meet the new bunny, and it's gonna be a beautiful thing when everybody bows down and sings the bunny song. Um, I don't think I'm familiar with that particular tune. Could you just hum a few bars? You know, I was hoping you'd ask. The bunny song is how all my employees will show just how much they love the bunny. How nothing is more important than the bunny. How they do anything for the bunny. And it goes something like this. 
the bunny, the bunny, whoa, I love the bunny. I don't love my soup or my bread, just the bunny, the bunny, the bunny, yeah, I love the bunny. I gave everything that I had for the bunny. I don't want no health food when it's time to feed. A big bag of bunnies is all that I need. I don't want nobody's to come out and play. I'll sit on my sofa, eat bunnies all day. I won't eat no beans, and I won't eat tofu. That stuff is for sissies, but bunnies. say if someone didn't quite agree with everything in that song so they didn't um didn't sing it what would happen what's that over there that's the furnace what's it for well that's where the bad bunnies go let's just say in my mind if you don't bow down and sing the song you're a bad bunny you don't mean... But I'm sure that won't happen. It's almost time for the ceremony. I'll see you out there. Now this was a pickle. That bunny song was chock full of stuff they knew was wrong. But if they don't sing it, Nezza says he's going to throw them in the furnace. Woo! Well, what would you do if you were them? I better hold that thought. The ceremony's starting. Thank you for attending today's festivities. It is with great pleasure that I present to you the object of our affection, your new best friend, the Bunny! Now it is time to bow and sing the Bunny Song! Hey, boss, those three guys don't look like they're bowing. Hmm? Aren't those our new junior executives? I think so. Maybe they're stuck. Let's find out. I said it's time to sing the bunny song. Sing the song. They ain't singing, boss. Sing! Think of me every day. Is that the bunny song? No, I don't think so. Are you crazy? That's the wrong song. Far away. Know that wherever you are, it is never too far. If you think of me, I'll be with you. Oh, that was beautiful. I'm going to be singing that song myself. As I throw you into the furnace, God sees them. Take them to the furnace. Rat Shack 
Mike and Benny will be right back after this short break. And now it's time for Silly Songs with Laddie, the part of the show where Laddie comes out and sings a silly song. Laddie will be performing the traditional Argentinian ballad, The Dance of the Cucumber, in its original Spanish. Bob the Tomato will translate. Miren al pepino, Watch the bien cucumber. como se See mueve, how he moves. como un león, like a lion. tras un ratón. Chasing a mouse. Miren al pepino, Watch the cucumber. que suave es oh, movimiento, smooth his motion. es como mentequilla like en un chango pelón. Bald monkey. Miren al pepino, Watch the cucumber. los vegetales, All the vegetables. enviren a su amigo, como ella quiere bailar, pepino bailarín, dancing cucumber. Pepino bailarín Dancing cucumber Pepino bailarín Dancing cucumber Baila, baila dance, ya Dance, dance, yeah Miren el tomate Look at the tomato No es triste Isn't it sad? Él no puede bailar He can't dance Pobre tomate Poor tomato Él desearía poder bailar Como el pepino He wishes he could dance Like the cucumber Libre y suavemente Free and smooth Pero no puede danzar But he, he can't Okay, stop the music what do you mean I can't dance? I can dance. Well, what about Uncle Louie's polka party? Didn't you see me dancing at Uncle Louie's polka party? No comprendo. No comprendo? I'll show you no comprendo. Mom, Dad, look over here. Get a picture of me next to the cucumber in authentic Argentinian garb. Okay, Junior, but we better hurry. I think the dwarves have your mother confused with someone else. <laughs> Say peas. Peas. Escuchen al pepino. Listen to the cucumber. Oigan su Hear voz fuerte. His strong como voice. un león. Like a lion. Listo a devorar. About to eat. Escuchen al pepino. Listen to the cucumber. Que dulce es su canto. How sweet his voice. Que sopla su garganta. Parece like a un trinar. Escuchen al Listen pepino. Listen to the cucumber. Los vegetales enviren a su amigo como él quiere cantar. Pepino cantador, pepino cantador, pepino cantador, canta, canta ya. Yeah. Escuchen al tomate, no es triste, él no puede cantar. Pobre tomate, él desearía poder cantar. Fuerte y luce como el pepino. Strong and sweet like the cucumber. Pero no puede. But he can't. Ni siquiera da un sorbido. Can't even whistle. All right, that's it, señor. Come over here and let me sing you a song. This has been Silly Songs with Laddie. Tune in next time to hear Laddie sing. Bob is really angry. I hope he doesn't catch me. It's so hard to run with the sombrero on my head. And now, back to our story. Is everyone comfortable? Good. Rack, I can't move my arms. Ah, uh, Benny, you don't have any arms. Oh. I've tried to be patient, I've tried to be kind. Can you tell me what the trouble is? Am I losing my mind? Now I didn't ask for much, just one simple little thing. Didn't ask you to part the waters, I just wanted to hear you sing. I gave you hats, I gave you ties, I let you eat my buddies, and this is how you repay me. But to show you what kind of guy I am, I'll ask you one more time. Will you or will you not sing the song? Well, you see, sir, our parents taught us to stand up for what we believe in. And God wants us to do what's right. And there's a lot of stuff in that song that's not right. So, we don't mean to be a bother. We hope you understand. But we cannot sing that song. I understand, boys. You do? Oh, 
Oh, yes. I understand that you're bad bunnies. Now, if I'm not mistaken, that truck belongs to me, Mr. Lunt. Oh, but look, my truck seems to be full of garbage. Mr. Lunt, is there anything you can do about that? Hey, no problem, boss. Yeah. I sure hope that you were right. Oh, Mr. Lunt? It wasn't me, boss. I said, nobody bakes my buddies. Listen here, young lady. If you don't plug that back in, you're gonna be in big trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody's ever gonna stand up to me again! to make you do things you weren't supposed to do. What was I thinking? I must have forgot everything that my mommy taught me. Can you ever forgive me? We forgive you. Oh, thanks. Is there anything I can do to make it up to you? Well, you could sing one of our songs. Well, how's it go? You know, I was hoping you'd ask. It's why she tells me what I need to know I got a lot of respect for that woman But sometimes when I'm playing with a buddy or two They're doing things that no, I'm not supposed to do Do you go along? Even though the things they do are wrong mm -hmm. I remember stand up Stand up, stand up For what you believe in Believe in, believe in God She's the one to back you up That you gotta be cool Remember what you learned in church and Sunday school Just check it out mm -hmm. The Bible tells us what it's all about Oh, you know that's right So if you have a question, go ask your dad And he can tell you if a thing is good or bad You'll make their day uh -huh. If you remember what your parents say What they say They told you 